It's hard to articulate what cougar spirit really is. It's one of those things, frankly, that you just have to experience. There's an extraordinary passion amongst alumni and friends that you just don't find anywhere else. And Dwayne and Terry are classic examples of the kind of passion that cougars exhibit and demonstrate and where they consistently show their commitment to WSU in a range of ways, both philanthropically and as volunteers and in leadership roles uh, in support of WSU. There is nothing at this university that the two of them have not impacted. And if there's something we need, whether it's an athletics facility, a, a scholarship opportunity, supporting our bowling team, I mean, it's just this wide variety of different things. Dwayne and Terry have always been there to say, we're gonna help you do it. We're gonna be leaders. We're gonna bring other people on board. They really stand out as asking leadership, what is it that you all need to be successful? And then being part of it and leading part of it. I know that Dwayne and Terry want what's best, not only for Pullman, but Washington State University, and they give their all to make sure that it happens. Time, talent, treasure. Dwayne has been a mentor. He has been a guest speaker. He has served on numerous committees, notably through athletics and the, and the College of Business. Dwayne grew up in Pullman, and so he's been a kook all his life. I, I do believe his father worked at WSU. I think Duane just absolutely loves not only WSU, but his community. They are everywhere. If there is a need of some kind at WSU, whether it be the evolution of Martin Stadium, or the Visitor Center, or a home for the WSU Foundation, or the leadership that is needed to move parts of the WSU family forward, they are omnipresent in those uh, environments. It's always predictable that if there's a challenge before WSU, you'll find Dwayne and Terry Brelsford engaged in it. We have the Brelsford Welcome Center. Anybody coming onto campus, that's one of the first things you sort of see and you know, you can look off and see the buildings up on the hillside, but that's the first thing that's there. And if I look at all the apartment complexes in town, a lot of the retail space, those are all things that Dwayne and Terry have been part of. Um, and I think it's that, hey, we want to see WSU grow, but we want to see the Pullman community thrive along with WSU that really makes what they do uh, particularly special and particularly unique. Uh, but it extends outside of just Pullman. So it turns out at our Tri-Cities campus, we have an apartment complex there that Dwayne also invested in and manages, and it's talking about expanding. So our Tri-Cities Cougs now have housing right next to campus that feels like part of the campus environment, again, because of Dwayne and Terry and their commitment to Washington State University. Individuals like the Brelsford inspire us all and make us think maybe I could do that, but I want to be like this and be able to give back to my university. Maybe not in the same capacity, but can I dig deep and give until it makes an impact. Thank you, Dwayne and Terry, for all that you've done for WSU and all that you will continue to do for WSU. And your generosity just absolutely knows no bounds. On behalf of the Cougar Nation, uh, we are so thankful for your leadership uh, and your support. Thank you for a lifetime of supporting Washington State University. And when you sort of add up all the things they've done for the university, whether it's financial, leadership, just being here through the years, supporting leadership, athletic directors, presidents, all those kind of things, it's an impressive list and it's a very deserved recognition for both of them.